So I, I put the, uh, oh, it was Cable 1. Um, the bass pattern I was using for the strumming was down, down, up, up, down, up. Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. But there's those Gs that happen after the hits normally. In this song, anyway, I'm using the, the box to mean just a big down, kill it thing. Down, kill it. Down, kill it. Like with the right hand. And there's uh, the Gs after the big down, kill it thing. I've got it written to the side of the first one. is kind of a an up, up. And I'm using right hand muting to kill the string, so it's kind of uh, set yourself up for an upstroke with the hand going to the string. Up, kill it with a ready for another up. Up, kill it, ready for another up. up. So it's weird because it's where you're going back to to set you up for the upstroke with the pick. But up, 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 up. and then I've got a couple other like lead in licks that can work there. That open E twice. First fret on the low E twice, second fret on the low E. That can work in place of that G, right? Kind of the G to lead back into the G. So that that's another one. And then oh, and I got one kind of down at the bottom. That oh, one, two is kind of that C leg. Right, trying to you yeah, you can almost kind of use that to lead into any G chord. And then you'll hear that there's the intro licks. I guess I should walk through those too. The open G string, third fret on the D, open D, third fret on the D. All right. Let's see. Yeah, how, how does that work at the very beginning? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Open three O three O three O three. If you wanted to use that to kind of intro the tune, um, and then randomly I put this other lick at the very very bottom that like helps lead from a G to a C chord. That lick that kind of turns up, it's open G twice, third fret on the D twice, first fret on the D twice, open D twice, to go to the C. So the way that would kind of work, like if you're doing the G's right before the C, you got four G's. Like G, two, three, four, G, two, three, four, G, two, three, four, lick. And I 
used to have it. I think you kind of get the idea. I can kind of lead it into the C chord. So that could be kind of cool too. And randomly at the very end, I got that last G marked as a blowout. What a blowout in Munson terms is, is go crazy. Right, lots of down ups. Then you do one big down and then you kill it. <laughs> and normally that makes people clap. It might not make you clap right now, but go down ups, big down, kill it. You know, that's just kind of a cool way to end a tune in general. But uh, awesome request. Hope that helps. Best of luck. Don't forget to subscribe